Hey girlies. I don't know why I felt this sudden urge to start a video. I just did. I was like sitting here and I was like, hmm. I don't know, I just feel like talking. I just have like ideas happening. Uh, my first thought, what, prov what provoked my thought to make this video? There we go. Um, because I go to New York. Yay, slash Coachella. Yay, slash Taylor Swift. <gasps> Yay. But it feels like there's a lot upcoming. I feel nervous, I feel excited. I feel like I cannot do anything else in the meantime. I thought it'd be fun to do like a little shop with me, you know? But I wanted to be like, we're sisters, we're besties, and we're like shopping together because, I don't know, it's fun. And I am definitely going to be checking out the secondhand vintage platforms in order to prepare for said events. But I have a lot of stuff on my Depop saved. I'm gonna scroll through it now. But first, I thought we could start the video by like going through what I've already saved. Oh my god, and you know another thing that I cannot stop doing? I cannot stop watching Bella Ramsey edits. All these edits, I can't take it. The one that's like, say he likes crazy girls, that he hates when I act crazy. I feel like it needs to be shared. Anything I do is to take a break from doing that. Okay, so on my homepage here, I have lots of cute shoes. For Coachella, I really want like a pair of like boxer boots that are like high, that I can like stomp my pussy in on in the desert. You know, that's what I want. Oh, this pair, mm -mm -mm. <laughs> so good. I fear these may be harder to style. 220 pounds. I just don't know if I can justify that. These are real leather and they're cute. They're so cute. I'm me convincing myself by the minute for like a purchase that no one's asking me to justify. And I'm really into like the lace up moment right now. Another pair of the topic of Coachella is these shoes. And we got these pink ones as well. Very similar vibes. Oh, so cute. Anyway, moving on to some clothes I have saved. <gasps> This Betsy Johnson dress. I'm this close to buying this like RN, like right now. I love a Capri pant moment. So with these shoes, are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Maybe I have to get these shoes too. I would want, love to rep my country. I actually literally don't care. My culture or nationality. Because I'm British, so England, great. This Cusa Barcelona zip up. Oh, with the ribbon. <laughs> this is cute. This is eight pounds actually look really cute with these nikes i love styling things that are like in my basket from depop because it does help me later like it's so scared things sell it like literally brings me anxiety all the time but yeah thank you for joining me today keep you updated basically okay i did some damage based off of what i said the last time i felt that a few things i just have to get so some arrived which is so exciting so i thought we could go through Kind of what I got. Damn. Oh, yay! That's who she is. Okay, so I got another one of my like Kangol hats. I have one in black and it's like actually my favorite thing. I actually love these hats like so much. And they're like so great for like spicing up an outfit. Like sometimes when I don't have like a hairstyle going on, bless you. Sometimes when I don't have like a hairstyle going on and like nothing's happening up here, like I need a hat. So she's really cute and I have my black one and I wear it to death. I'm really wearing my dress over my pants oh my god this is like so editorial wait what what was that you can also like wear her forward obviously but then this is giving like pee blinders so i kind of like <laughs> usually wear it backwards okay cool we got that oh these are slay oh they're like archive diesel kitten heels. I just love, I love borderline ugly shoes. That is like my go-to thing right now. Borderline ugly shoes, people. That's the moment. Some of this might be for an ad. I actually don't even know what I've got here. So I bought this. My England top. I love England. I'm patriotic. That with like a gray mini skirt, white tights, and those kitten heels. Are you kidding me? It would be giving like so sporty, sexy, cute, like Spice Girls. The theme of this video. I'm like sporty Spice Girl haul. <gasps> no. Yes. Guys, capris for spring. I am like gonna be such a capri girly. And they have like a little drawstring as well. So you can like, you know, you gotta cinch the cobs. Question mark. Oh, I think I know what this is. Are you kidding me? 
Oh my god, this is actually kind of weird, but like the fabric reminds me of my old school bag. We had like school merch. Is that the right word? You know, it wasn't like in the UK or like the US where you can like wear what you want or like wear whatever backpack you want. It was like a specific way to have. And it felt just like this bag, which I don't know if that's triggering me or not. I love this strap. Like this at Coachella is gonna be perfect because it's like brand name of this bag. For those wondering, is George, Gina, and Lucy. Like that. George, Gina, and Lucy. Kidding me? Look at the little butterfly. I mean, maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I'm missing out on something, but I've never seen these anywhere before. I feel like they're a nice, unique piece that I'm not going to see a lot. And when I saw they were 45 pounds, all the other ones I've been looking at were so expensive. And like, they're in such good condition. A Mwah. Until next haul. This is giving main character in a 2000s movie. Like the way the movie starts. You're like, dear diary. But it's the beginning of the month. Um, it's been a couple weeks since I placed my last orders. And last time, I obviously just showed you guys what I bought. Well, I showed you, well, I showed you my saves. And then I kind of showed you what I bought right when it came. Um, I think a couple of other things have come since then. I may have some things in my bag. Um, and we're gonna look through that and then I'm gonna make some some decisions because yeah I fly to New York in like oh my god in literally like 14 days. So let's go through what I found. But my page is just like ran down with kitten heels. Ooh, this is cute. Oh I love Oh, I just have like, I have the best shoes saved in my Depop saves and they're like all not my size. It's so frustrating. I, I think I'm such a shoe girly, but I'm also like such an impractical shoe girly. Like I'm not, I'm not like a sneakers type of gal, you know? I have to like make myself buy practical shoes because I feel like I never, I never do. Like I end up buying like kitten heels or like pointed toe heel boots that are like up to my thighs. Like why am I doing this? Oh, I love this. I love a stripey moment. Oh, this is also Miss Sixty. If you're liking the stuff that's like coming up, they're like a great brand. I have a lot from Miss 60. I have a lot from Jane Norman. I try to like take note of the brands that I like the most. And then I search for them. But for the most part, when I'm shopping, I'm just looking at my like for you, my like suggested for you. If I am like looking for something, if I'm looking for like, I don't know, an Afghan coat, right? And I want this like particular one. What I'll do is I'll like search Afghan coat, sure. And then I'll go through the ones that come up and I'll find like a bunch that I like, even if they're not perfect. I'll find a bunch that I like like the look of. If they're like really cute, they're not my size. Like, likey, we like it. So it, like the algorithm kind of like can understand what you enjoy and what your taste is. And then what starts to happen is like the next day they'll come up with my suggested for you. And then all of a sudden there's like 10 that are like great options. So my advice is be patient. Have a look around for something and then let it like simmer into your algorithm first. And it's vintage Burberry Capri trousers. I love Anna Wet and Shot. 55 pounds for vintage Burberry? It's amazing. I would really love to find some, another, a new pair of new rock or like these Roxy shoes. Those are not the best condition, but like, yeah. Something like a platform moment. Oh, I really want to find a pair of heels like this with like a rose on it. But every time I see a pair, they're like, not my size. Oh, stop it right now. They're expensive. Oh no, but they're so cute. Oh, love these. Super rare, sickest 90s platform trainer ever. They are in really good condition. Okay, now that is done. God, I'm actually also like a mess. I'm such a mess right now. Okay, so now that we've done with that, I'm thinking I'm going to, I'm gonna have a look on eBay and like vintage. Oh, <laughs> okay. Also, every time I see a pair of these, I feel like they must have been released like so long ago. Because every time I see a pair of these, they are busted. Okay, let me have a look on Depop and see if there's any more. I feel like it's a very Depop kind of item. 300? Oh my god, this is a really cool top. Oh my god, look at the back! No way! That's insanely cool. I want to have a look at some of the handbags. Okay, salute. Oh, stop. It's like a rose bag. No, that's so cute. I swear after this much time, my ability to make decisions goes out the window. But I have bought some things. When it all comes, 
I will do a little haul. I'm currently in my going downstairs to get packages at 9 a.m. in the morning fit. <laughs> I still have to shower, I still have to get ready, but I got some packages this morning, so I wanted to get them to see what I got and do a little unboxing, a little unboxing. So that being said, we got more packages today. Great, so I thought we could open them before I get ready for my day. Where am I confused with this? Oh, cute belt. Okay, I actually think this is a gifting. Which is so cute. Thank you. This is so cute. This is from, oh my god, I can't remember the name for the life of me. Yes, Kath and Rosa. I saw like the label in here and I was like, K and R? Kath and Rosa. Oh my god. Also, the label is so cute. But look at how cute these are. These are like some like jeans, denim cargoes. I would feel like they're more denim cargoes. And I'm obsessed. Look at the like print on the butt. That is so cute. And there's like a little buckle as well on the butt. Can't wait to try this on. Next up, this is so cute. It's like this little gingham shirt. Oh, I'm obsessed. I think this is so cute. Kind of imagine this in the summer with like a pair of bloomers um, and like some like black knee high boots or like a pair of colorful knee high boots even. I feel like that's so like cute and chic and like imagine like with little pigtails. I don't know, I think that was so cute. I think this is still from like the first part. Oh my god, I've been waiting for this one. Oh my god. <gasps> she is like the cutest little bag ever. I recently, I just filmed a video yesterday where I talk about kind of like my current obsessions. Um, like my favorite fashion things. Uh, I think, yeah, trends of this year as well. Um, and one of them that I kind of put into a category was like Met Gala Heavenly Bodies. And I feel like this is so that. This little guest bag. Are you kidding me? How cute is that? Oh, I got a little beanie. Um, someone told me this is cute. Or am I tripping? <laughs> this is cute, right? Be honest. Okay, enough of that. Now I've created a mess. I think I really gotta go get ready. But yeah, nah. Rambling on. I'll see you when I have more packages. Hello, it is now quite a while later. I. I feel like I forget how long sometimes if you buy like second hand online and stuff, how long it can take to come. Um, it's currently, what's the date? Thursday, the 13th of April. And I leave for New York City in exactly four days. Wow. I got like most of my things. I think there's like maybe one or two things that haven't come in time, but that's okay. So yeah, let's start. First up, Capri pants. If you haven't watched my most recent video, I talked through like my current fashion life obsessions and on that list of course was capri pants and I'm actually just obsessed with these ones. I love like a cargo, I love all types of capris, cargo capris, skinny capris, I don't know, there's also types of capris but I love these ones. This pair of pants, I actually bought these off the video, these were um, an in-person purchase actually you know in person gifting um i was gonna purchase them but my friend izzy um she runs brown bread clothing i'll put it here on the screen she has a whole bunch of these dead stock skirt trouser pants so if you like these she actually has a whole bunch of dead stock ones if you're interested um but these are so cute and they're like attached which i actually love um so there's like these gray suit trousers with a skirt over i feel like they're like a good spring essential Although these actually are quite long on me. I'm five foot three and they're too long on me. So I feel like they're perfect for someone like taller. Um, but I'm just gonna get them tailored because I feel like they're worth it. Next up, I was kind of nervous about this purchase um, because uh, when I ordered it, it like said mini skirt. I was like, this is not like a mini skirt. It's the perfect length. It's like a perfect midi length, which I love. It's like the length that I love because I feel like I'm short. I have to be like quite careful about what length skirts I wear and this is perfect it like just goes above my knees these are great and I love the colors in them they're like kind of it's like blue with like the red and yellow accents which I like that um because then you can kind of pair like quite a lot with it and like also the white so like it's kind of like multicolor, but when you look at it it's just like blue um but that like gives you like more to play around with when you put together an outfit I'm obsessed with this what brand oh wait what brand was this this was unknown I actually think it's a school skirt <laughs> I think like this mom was just like selling her like daughter's school skirt. Here I am. The Y2K girlies are coming. This one is called, it says Gelato Peak. 
whatever that means. Oh, I still got my hair done this weekend. I went to go visit my dad and I got my hair done. But yeah, this is so cute. It's like a baby doll dress. I love this silhouette. Oh, are you joking? Over a pair of jeans. I thought that would be really cute. What do you think? I love this and I love the color. I think it was just like, it's just like very delicate. Love her. The next two items are of a similar topic and these were both gifted by We Gang Young. This is the brand here. We Gang Young. Um, these were gifted and when they reached out to me, I was like, yes, please, because I'm going to Coachella and I feel like that was also one of the topics of this video was to kind of find some stuff for Coachella. And I feel like this is a perfect option. I mean, it's definitely like very festival. Look at her. Okay, wait, I feel like I'm holding it really badly, but it like ties here at the front as well. And these two are extremely similar. So we have this one. We also have this one. And I feel like basically I'm going to give one to my sister to wear because she's struggling with what to wear. And I feel like it would be cute because we like kind of matching. This was like a cute little bargain. This is like just um, a blue mini skirt. Again, I'm loving like the delicate pieces lately. Um, I love the length of this like skirt. Um, it's really easy, comfy, and I don't know what brand it is. Again, it has no label, but I got this for really cheap, and it just kind of came up on like my explore page, and it was like five pounds. So I was like, yep, yeah, five or ten, ten. I can't remember. It was like around that range. I remember it not being expensive. Um, but yeah, so cute. I don't know if it's like I included that in my like shop with me. Next up, I have this little poncho moment. My friend Bella, she was like, bring ponchos back, and I was like, girl, you know what? Yes, I'm like all, li I'm living for it. I think it's like. So fun. Anything that's like another addition to like accessorize in my wardrobe, I'm here for it. I want it. I got this like zip up. I got this more recently too. So bloody cute. Again, I think great for spring. I love a pink moment. And this is um Lonsdale, I think. Yeah, it's a Lonsdale. Like just zip up hoodie. Kind of easy, kind of straightforward. And the reason I bought it actually was I thought it would look really cute with the skirt. Right? This was very as per my Pinterest board. Insert photo here. I found this like save the queen don't know why I'm holding like that save the queen top I think that's so cool it's kind of a little funky a little different but I really like it I think it's like very unique next up a pair of shoes she these I'm actually obsessed with these I think this might be like I don't know I'm such a shoe girly like the two three pairs of shoes I bought in this haul I feel like might be like my favorite part of the entire haul the colors I'm obsessed it reminds me a lot of the like Prada, Mew Mew-esque shoes without being like 500 pounds. <laughs> Never would have thought, right? Orange and green. Next up, I got this vintage Betsy Johnson dress. Clap everybody, clap. She's so gorgeous. And the way this fits me, I have like a little video, I'll insert clip here. This is also probably maybe one of my favorite pieces and it fits like a glove because it has like these like ties around the back and you can like, got this little like, lace burgundy bolero this is every time i go to say what the brand is there is actually no label but again just a good like little layering piece to kind of play around with a simple outfit in the spring on the topic of capris another pair of capris which i actually wore recently so there's a belt in them but these like fit so well i got these on vintage for like 10 pounds these are like old label necks i bet you Something for nothing. They were like in the boys section or some shit. Um, but they're so cute. And they fit me like a glove. I really like them. And they sit like the waisted. So those were a great purchase. And I just like the wash. Um, I think it's very like 2000s style, the wash of them. Next up, I think, is my Coachella outfit three. Um, because, oh my god. This is like the beautiful, most beautiful thing I've ever seen. And it's actually a swimsuit. It's like beachwear. This is Blue Marine. This is like one of my favorite brands. Well, they still exist, but like one of my favorite brands slash my favorite brands of the 2000s era. This swim set, are you kidding me? And wait for the, wait for the, wait for the pants. On the topic of swimwear, I'm not really like big into like purchasing swimwear because I live in London, so I never swim. But I found, I bought this at the Peachy Den uh, sample sale and it's so cute. I love the colors. I love a gingham moment in, in any shape or form. I love these, I'm obsessed, and it fits like a glove. So this little gingham mesh top, again, kind of just easy, something fun to play around with. I've tied a blue ribbon on it for some reason. What did I style it with? I style it with something where that blue ribbon was significant. 
obviously so cute i love that i love the way it fits love the colors next up we have this little lace midi skirt pink again this is a pretty good bargain she's so cute i love all the lace skirt moments happening right now and i thought it was fun to go for like a different color i already have a white one so i think like a little pink one this would also look cute with like a little zip up little lacy sporty moment love it yes i got this from fines again from brown bread clothing shout out brown bread clothing this is so cute it's like a little belt um and it's like just mesh organza i just i love i love love the colors i thought it was just a really cute accessory to like spice up some outfits next up which i feel like was a bit off topic i feel like i was like deluded in telling myself this was like a spring jacket but i think it, it i'm really i don't regret it i think it's gorgeous oh are you kidding me? I love leopard print. I love leopard print so much. Next up, I got these boxing boots. I love a boxing boot at the moment. I'm seeing like them everywhere. And I just love this pair. I thought this pair would be so fun and cute for Coachella. Stomping around in the dust. I feel like these are my dust stomping boots. And a nice neutral to go with a lot of things. Next up. Okay, this is like probably one of my favorite things of the whole. Capri. These capris are actually to die for. Wait until you see the back. Are you kidding me? <gasps> and like this pattern like goes under my butt like perfectly. It, it looks so cute on it. So yeah, that is officially my spring summer wardrobe shopping spree. I hope you enjoyed kind of shopping with me and seeing my process. It can be very like indecisive at times. But I like to keep things circular. I'm currently in the midst of doing like a wardrobe sale as well. As I make space for new things, um, I, it's just fun to find some really cool pieces. It's one of my favorite things to do, but I'm definitely spring, summer ready. I'm really excited to like have these pieces to style and take with me to New York. Let me know what you want to see next. I'm going to be taking you with me to New York, with me to Coachella. I really want to like document my outfits i really have been having so much fun making these videos so if you enjoyed please leave a like comment subscribe let me know you want to see all of the above and i hope you got inspired in some way style wise inspired by my style inspired to embrace your own style whatever that may be and just wear whatever you want to wear i love you so much and thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you next time Mwah. bye